Well, and I believed everything I was taught. I was water baptized into things, whatever the church said, and, and but I didn't know a, a personal relationship with God, and I didn't know you could have one until I went to that Stonecrop Bible study. Now, eight years after I accepted the Lord through that Stonecrop study, uh, my daughter, 14 years old, passed away. Her heart stopped while she was playing racquetball, and that's where everything changed in my life. I had to, I had to understand how, why, and that's when I began reading the Bible as much because the Bible is God's word. And friends were comf comforting me all the time. God loves you, but I couldn't believe it at the time. I had to hear from Him, and so when I began reading the Bible almost 24 hours a day at, the, at first, really just love poured out of those pages to me. I mean, even to the point where it felt like God was hugging me and holding me, letting me know he would get me through this. And he showed me he wasn't punishing me. You know, as long as we're here, there's going to be problems and difficulties and tragedies. And then he showed me how much he loved me by showing me the tremendous sacrifice that God the Father made in giving his only begotten son to die for me, to pay the penalties for my sin. And that's when probably the deep love for the Lord began during that time. It was a horrible, difficult time, and yet the sweetest time, because that changed everything. That changed my relationship to extremely personal. And then, you know, just life changes. I had several medical issues and even six hip surgeries, which is unheard of, <laughs> you know, and I'm just now being able to walk again and get along, shop again, you know, that was pretty good. <laughs> um, but anyway, when I'm going through a difficult time, that time alone with God is the most precious time ever because he does comfort me. He does give me joy in the midst of, of, of it. And I've had people say that to me, you're joyful. How are you joyful when you're in pain? And, and I'm, I don't know, I guess, but I do know. <laughs> it's the Lord. He just gives me peace and joy. I love it. And hope.